Hello friends, this is the type of numerical in which the water lifting is involved. The question is, a water pump, hai. the water pump is has lifted 50 liters in let's say x amount of time. We are not considering time right now. All that we know is it has lifted 50 liters of water. They are asking find out the work done by the pump. Very simple. I know work done is force into distance. Now, your water was it was somewhere in the tank. It has moved at a height of let's say it is given at 50 meter or let's say 10 meter. 10 meter ki height pe aapne water ko pahuncha diya. So how much force will be applied by the water pump? The force applied by the water pump will be exactly same as its ka weight. Same concept. The force by the pump will be same as the weight of the water. So work done will be weight of the water multiplied by 10 meter. Now the challenge is how to find the weight of the water. Weight of the water kya hota hai? Mass of the water into gravity into 10. I know I am using the gravity of 10. So that is mass into 100. Now the challenge is how to find the mass of 50 liter water. Take it. Here some conversion you need to memorize. 1 ml is 1 gram. Okay. 1 liter is 1 kg. 1 ml is same as 1 millimeter cube. 1 liter is same as 1 decimeter cube. And if I take 1 meter cube, that is 1000 liter and that is 1000 kg. This is the conversion that we need to know. So friends, it's now very simple. 50 liter means how many kg? 50 kg. So we come back here. 50 into 100 and that is 5000 joule is the answer. So the only twist here was when I am lifting the water up, the force by the pump will be same as the weight of the water. And weight of the water is nothing but mass into gravity, where mass is taken as the mass of the water, but the water is given in the volume. So I know the volume conversion of 1 liter as 1 kg. So 50 liter is how much? 50 kg into 100, 5000 joule. Okay. Thank you so much.